Thursday the 7th of March 2024. First reading. Reading from the book of Jeremiah. These were my orders, listen to my voice, then I will be your God and you shall be my people. Follow right to the end the way that I mark out for you, and you will prosper. But they did not listen, they did not pay attention, they followed the dictates of their own evil hearts, refused to face me, and turned their backs on me. From the day your ancestors came out of the land of Egypt until today, day after day I have persistently sent you all my servants, the prophets. But they have not listened to me, have not paid attention, they have grown stubborn and behaved worse than their ancestors. You may say all these words to them, they will not listen to you. You may call them, they will not answer. So tell them this, here is the nation that will not listen to the voice of the Lord its God nor take correction. Sincerity is no more, it has vanished from their mouths. Responsorial Psalm Oh that today you would listen to his voice, harden not your hearts. Come, ring out our joy to the Lord, hail the rock who saves us. Let us come before him, giving thanks. With songs let us hail the Lord. Oh that today you would listen to his voice, harden not your hearts. Come in, let us bow and bend low. Let us kneel before the God who made us, for he is our God and we, the people who belong to his pasture, the flock that is led by his hand. Oh that today you would listen to his voice, harden not your hearts. Oh that today you would listen to his voice, Harden not your hearts as at Meribah, as on that day at Massa in the desert, when your fathers put me to the test, when they tried me, though they saw my work. Oh, that today you would listen to his voice. Harden not your hearts. Gospel Acclamation Praise to you, O Christ, King of eternal glory. Shake off all your sins, it is the Lord who speaks, and make yourselves a new heart and a new spirit. Praise to you, O Christ, King of eternal glory. Gospel Reading from the book of Luke Jesus was casting out a devil and it was dumb, but when the devil had gone out the dumb man spoke, and the people were amazed. But some of them said, It is through Beelzebul, the prince of devils, that he casts out devils. Others asked him as a test for a sign from heaven, but knowing what they were thinking, he said to them, every kingdom divided against itself is heading for ruin, and a household divided against itself collapses. So too with Satan, if he is divided against himself, how can his kingdom stand? Since you assert that it is through Beelzebul that I cast out devils. Now if it is through Beelzebul that I cast out devils, through whom do your own experts cast them out? Let them be your judges then. But if it is through the finger of God that I cast out devils, then know that the kingdom of God has overtaken you. So long as a strong man fully armed guards his own palace, his goods are undisturbed. But when someone stronger than he is attacks and defeats him, the stronger man takes away all the weapons he relied on and shares out his spoil. He who is not with me is against me, and he who does not gather with me scatters. Gospel of the Lord